Hi, y'all. It's Mike's. Yeah. Yep, you get to see my bloopers because I don't have not got this editing thing figured out. But hi, it's Mike. Mike's RV Camping. Welcome to my channel, people. It's been a day or two since I posted, so I thought I'd throw another one out there. Um, it's getting close to Christmas time. Uh, I got my hair cut. Get rid of the crazy curls that made me look like I had a white guy fro. Well, curls like that you do because they're like, woo, spiral curls. And they, they're so crazy until they get long enough to do something with. And trust me, it takes more than a nine months since my last haircut. So, with that being said, we're going to definitely have to keep it short. Because it's going to take, it takes it like at least a year. Let's see, seven months. Eight months. August was my last haircut for this one. So, August. But, no, I'm sorry, not August, but April. Got May. June. July. August. September. That's five months. October, November, December. Eight months. So see, it would have took at least a year for it to get halfway decent where I could do something with it. And it's thick. Because I got a lot of this hair up here. Look at all that hair. A lot of hair. Yeah, I know. Salt and pepper. You know what? I ain't worried about it. Nah, I really ain't. You know what really sucks? Is not knowing <clears throat> to make plans or not for New Year's. I was wanting to make plans for New Year's, but my travel friend isn't sure what they're doing yet. They may have to take a couple days extra off work, and they may have to make it up then. I don't yeah. I'll find out soon, I hope. Um, maybe Monday or Tuesday. But if I can't go then okay I'm still going to try to get this I still got to get my trailer inspected so I'm going to try to do that soon as possible yeah I am so I got, I'm, I'm itching in the corner there we go uh, but and nothing else I try to put some extra money aside for my trip in April is definitely happening well, we're not there to Mexico for a couple weeks, then maybe a month, and then come back home. Um, depends on what this trailer does. If this trailer passes, which I'm kind of thinking it's not going to inspection because if it doesn't then I can't get a Kentucky title and it'll have this terrible red sticker on the side saying salvage not suitable for human habitation <sighs> but the upside is my Layton by Skyline it's habitable for human habitation and I'll be more than happy to hook that little 26-foot lightweight up behind my truck and drag its happy butt out west. It's got newer tires, better tires. Uh, newer tires, but better tires than this one has on it. Um, this one pulls good. It's heavier. It's bigger. It's roomier. More practical, more, com more practical for living. But uh, I used to live in 24-foot classy motorhome but it was set up different and it worked great this is the other one's a 26 foot lightweight um front bedroom rear bunk rear bath this one's front bedroom rear bunk rear bath this one's supposed to only be 27 foot but trust me it's bigger than 27 foot. I done figured that out. Because I did some thinking and some eyeballing and realized 
This thing's about 32 foot. Because I got it parked next to my mom's house. And it's 30 feet wide. And this thing's hella longer than her house is wide. I'm talking a couple feet at least. Because I got it parked two feet from the fence. Or less than two feet from the fence. And the whole tongue and part of the bedroom is in front of her house. So, hmm. That makes this one a 32 footer. I got it figured out. So, and that's total weighed uh, 5,800 pounds. 32 footers weigh closer to 6,000. Close. About, what does this thing weigh? I had to look it up. But LE is supposed to be kind of a lighter model. But it's got the slide. It's got some upgrades on the interior. So it probably does weigh more. But that's okay. If I'm going to go out west, I will take my TV, transfer it over there. Because I can switch it out, mine it on that mount. Um, take the antenna cable, an antenna, when I get there the antenna up if I need to for tape but I think it's got free cable and I had to check see if that one's got free Wi-Fi a lot of them can have free Wi-Fi but um, if not I find out how much the Wi-Fi is if it's not a lot then I go that route um, but you know I am you know been doing this full-time living for three years now or it'll be three years next month. Three years. I know for sure. Three years I've been doing the camper thing. And you know what? Guess what? I like it a lot. It's great. For me. For me, it is great. Um, my dog likes it. Just don't tell her she's a dog. She gets butt hurt. Literally. I told her she was a good dog today, and she looked like I scolded her. She like looked away like whatever. And I told her she was a good human, and then she got happy. But she thinks she's a person, not a dog. So she thinks part of a human pack, not part of a dog pack. But she's still lovable. So anyhow, I got distracted by TV for just a second. So anyhow, y'all, uh, y'all have a good night or good day, depending on when you see this. And I will see you all on my next video, which hopefully will be, I'm going to start trying to do more videos. It may just be a short, maybe a longer one. I'm going to start doing more videos, people. I'm thinking maybe if I just start doing more videos, I get more followers. And that's what I want. I want more subscribers, more people to subscribe and like my videos and watch them because I think that would be awesome. Yep. All right. So, folks, remember, be safe out there. Um, stay warm because it's cold this time of year. So, stay warm. Uh... Y'all, just be safe, stay warm, and leave no trace when you pull out, leave no trace.